Becca the Bargainer and I'm back with a collective haul. I went to Michael's, Hancock Fabrics, and then two thrift stores. So if you're interested, just keep watching. At Michael's I got some really good deals and so let me show you the first thing. I picked up these little tags. There are 10 tags and I paid $2.99 for these. Um, they resemble chalkboard, like a chalkboard label, and um, but you can put them in your home to organize and you can also put them on gifts. I picked up this little marker to use with them instead of a chalkboard marker. I paid a dollar for this and it's the Studio G brand. It's a bullet marker in the silver color. So I'm gonna use it as a chalkboard marker. I didn't wanna spend the extra money for a chalkboard marker and I thought once I write it down, I'm not gonna to need to change it so I'll just get that. I picked up three of the $1.50 um, items they had. They have some really cute things in their bins there. I picked up this um, note card set. It's a Paris scene. It's so, so pretty. I also got a pet pencil set, five pencils for $1.50 and a beautiful stamp to go with it. So yeah, that's really nice. Okay, the next thing I purchased was like one of my favorite things that I got there and it was this note card set. There were there are 80 note cards with the envelopes and it said hot buy. It was 70% off. So originally I believe it was $19.99. I think it may have been $24.99. Anyway, it was 70% off that. I paid $5.99 for this. And I was so excited to get this. I was like I was just like running up and down the store. No, <laughs> I wasn't doing that. But I was really pumped to get it. I'm to show you these cards. They're so pretty and I wanted to show you each one. So let me just go through and show you. Um, my plan is to make some sets of these, like sets of like 10 card note cards and give them as gifts. Um, I get five of each card. So I was gonna make a couple different sets and you know set them aside for gifts and stuff. I think it'd be really nice. But I wanted to show you the different patterns. Um, they're beautiful. This is like right up my alley. I love these cards. And I'm, I'm going to, um, you know, some of these simpler ones I'm going to fix or not fix, but just, you know, change and embellish them. So I'm excited to do that. I love projects like that. And there's a lot of simpler ones, um, simpler ones here so those are all the cards and I did get five of each so I'm so excited to at Michael's I also picked up this um, can opener it's the hands-free automatic tornado can opener and they these were in the clearance section they were most of these were $12.99 uh, on clearance the tags at $12.99 but this one actually was priced incorrectly it was at $2.99 and so I said well I'm gonna ask them at the register if they will accept $2.99 for it and see if I can get it for $2.99 but we really needed a new um, can opener and it's supposed to take off the entire lid of the can which I thought was an interesting concept and so I do need to put batteries in it but we were actually needing a new can opener so I got this for $2.99 they let me get it um, for the price that it said because it was you know a mistake or whatever so that was totally awesome. I was so pumped about that. And um, so yeah, that was another good find. The next thing I got was from Hancock Fabrics and I actually got two pair of earrings. They were originally $6.99 and $7.99 and I actually ended up paying $1.80 each. They were um, on sale for $3 each and then it was 30% off of that. So if you are looking for earrings and they're, they're pretty nice quality, I would compare them to Target earrings the quality of them but yeah um they're really nice and i only paid a dollar eighty right now i would definitely check out hancock fabric earrings um they're really beautiful they had a lot of different ones some were only a dollar and you get 30 percent off that which not bad and so anyway i just wanted to share that with you and i really love the different designs of these i've always wanted to get like this kind of earring and i never have and so i'm really excited to get it for that price So the first thing I wanted to show you is this awesome organizer. I went to a, a local thrift store and paid $1.99 for it. It's one that you can use for cans and I'm going to use it in my pantry for two, two rows of cans. I paid $1.99 for this. I got this awesome vase. Uh, 
de decoration. I'm not really sure what you would call this, but it has seashells all over it. It's gorgeous, and I'm going to decorate this, use this for decoration in my home. I paid $2.99 for it. I'll probably take this out and just put some, you know, um, foliage in there or whatever. So we'll see. I don't know where it's going to go, but it's so pretty. And then I got this uh, necklace at a thrift store and it's so beautiful it has purple um you know different decor on it and it's really pretty i don't know where it's from but um it's nice quality and i paid 2.99 for it i have a sweater that will go really the next nice section, with this. I, i'm gonna show you some purses that i found i went to a chkd thrift store and i found two the first one is an ll bean purse it is called actually a tote and it has a zipper and it's very clean inside it doesn't even look used at all it's um, called LL Bean boat and tote and I love it it's so nautical looking and I'll probably use this when we go on the boat for my cell phone and for you know different things like that I paid 58 cents guys 58 cents. I could not believe it and I love it so adorable it has a zipper so it won't you know things will not fall out of it so I got this purse the next thing I got was another purse, and it is it actually has my last initial. And when I found this purse, I could not believe it because I already have a purse just like it. <laughs> okay, I, this was a gift from a friend a couple years ago. The bow actually fell off. And so this is my first initial. This is my second initial or my last initial. And I found this purse for $2.58. It's a beautiful purse, and I don't know if you've ever heard of the brand, but it's, um, let's see, it is called Manual Woodworkers and Weavers um, brand. It's really pretty. It's in good condition. I think it's brand new, um, and so I love it. It's gorgeous and um, very classic looking, so... Mm -hmm. 